hi everyone welcome to lighthearted today i'm going to do a kit unboxing of one of my reborn baby dolls that will be completed by an artist you're about to see a blank kit though um, i wanted to also tell you about my doll club which is the southern charm doll club it's for anyone who would like to join in the tennessee area uh, we will be doing some meetups and stuff in kentucky as well but just wanted to let you guys know about my dog club and to get started on this kit unboxing. This is a very chunky baby. This baby was sculpted by Laura Lee Eagles. This is Charlotte Toddler. She actually sculpted this baby after her 11 month old granddaughter, but my baby is going to be a boy. So um, I just can't wait to dig into this box because I just want to share with you guys my excitement. Um, a lot of people don't understand the aspect of reborn doll collecting, but it's just so fun. And to appreciate all the artistry that goes into these dolls, from the sculptor to the artist that brings them to life, it's, it's just an amazing process. So today I want to share with you this awesome kit unboxing. So you guys can take a look into my doll collecting world. Baby. <laughs> I got the COA out of the box already. Because I cut the top open and didn't want to show any addresses or anything. I want to get her little COA out so you can see it. But it is Charlotte, 11 months, first edition. And she's number 357 of 1,000. And it is signed by Laura Lee Eagles. I don't know if I should turn my light on. I don't know if that helps or not. But a very nice certificate. I love it. I think the light actually makes it a little bit worse. It's just so gray out today. It's just been rainy and drizzly and everything all day. So the lighting's not going to be that great. But yeah. And then on the back, it has another little picture of her. And it says Charlotte again by LLE. It's got a little crown on there. And then it says first edition, one Watson. So very nice certificate. I really like that. So now we're going to look at her chunky little limbs and her head. So I'm going to get everything out and put it onto this blanket, which I keep saying to her, mine is actually going to be a boy. So I'm going to say I'm going to put him onto the blanket and I'm going to position the camera so that you can see a little bit. Oh my, <laughs> this is a load of baby here. So look at all that chunkiness. Look at that chunky head. Oh my gosh, I love him. The vinyl is fine soft. And the head is sculpted to be leaning just a little bit. It's kind of got a little tilt, which I think is really cute. And just super chunky. I just think she's adorable. I'm so excited, y'all. I cannot wait. Cannot wait. Look at that little chubby fat roll back here. <laughs> So that's her head. This is the neck ring and plugs because it came together as a set. So, um, I don't know if that neck ring is going to fit or not. It doesn't look big enough to go around it. But that's the one they sent with it, so we'll see if it fits. But I want her to have a neck ring or him to have a neck ring because it's going to be such a chunky baby. Oh my goodness, these chunky legs. Look at these legs. Really, really chunky thighs. <laughs> Fat rolls on the inside. Look at these ankles. I am loving it. <laughs> loving her. Look at that. I mean, just look at that thigh, y'all, in my hand. Look at that thigh. So chunky. Lots of great little detail. This baby is going to be adorable. Right, let's get these little chunky arms out. So she's got one hand that is got like a little, like she's pointing or like she's going to like pinch something to grasp it. 
gosh, the chunk is so real, you guys. And I'm sorry, it's such a dreary day and the lighting is not good, but we're doing the best we can. But oh my goodness, this arm, <laughs> this little chunky arm. And then this little hand is, it's closed up, but it does have some fingers that are like upward a little bit. I love all the junkiness. My camera's having trouble focusing because, because it's such a dreary, rainy day. And this is her body, or his body. I do have a torso on the way. Um, and some eyes. And as soon as everything arrives, he's going to be going to his artist. And the artist of this baby is going to be Doodlebug the Reborn Nursery. You can find her on Facebook, and she's got some really pretty pictures of her cute baby, so um, I may have to contact them about that. I mean, yeah, I mean, <laughs> that's not going on there. That is not the right size in that green. There she is. Oh, that's going on there. So I have to let them know that I don't think this is right. I don't think that's going to fit. But yeah, let me put all of the limbs and the head and everything together just so you can see the sheer size of this baby because oh my goodness he's going to be gigantic this is an overhead view and this baby is from one end to the other this is like a really big basket i have sit on a table a changing table right now and he's taking up like <laughs> the whole basket but i just love him oh my goodness i love him i cannot wait this baby is just going to be beautiful. I'm so excited. Eek. So, so excited. Look at the chubby dies. <laughs> but that is it for my kit opening. And the next time you see this baby, it will be in a box opening and he will be completed. So I can't wait. I don't know how long it'll take. I've got to wait for the torso to come in and the eyes to come in. And this artist is local to me, so I can like drive to her. I don't have to wait for my stuff to be mailed, which I think is awesome. So, um, as soon as I get the rest of the items in, I'm going to be taking them to her. And then when he's finished, I'll be going to pick him up. So that's going to be so great. Like, I'm always just like on pins and needles waiting for the mail. And I know shipping like a baby this big to be shipped. Oh my goodness. The USPS has went up on their rates. And, you know, a baby this size would be quite a bit. And I can use way less gas to go get him. But that's all for now, y'all. Thank you so much for watching. And I hope you have enjoyed watching my kit opening of Charlotte by Laura Lee Eaton.